these infelicitations, YouTube. Throwback Thursday, so that means it's time to bring the heat on this poor little town. That's a uh, it's a neat little place to try and conquer. <clears throat> Gonna have to go up that road. Hmm, don't like that. Um, also, Anticombogios and the Headhunters are going to be showing up right over here. <laughs> Directly on the other side of where those three enemy ships are going to be. And I have more reinforcements? I thought we only had two forces. This might be the Onager, where the uh, Anticombogios and the Onager will arrive. So I'm going to... Uh, it's a long way to go, but I think I, think I should deploy <clears throat> the army over here. Just to keep my forces together. Um, the enemy has like three ships with a crew of 84, so I'm not too terribly worried about the threat from the sea. Um, there's an army here and a garrison here. I just... Uh, I don't see a good route to go from here. Unless I take the sea road, maybe. a really long way to fight. Ugh. Ugh. I don't know. Maybe this is the better idea. Just hit them from two different directions. Try to get into Capogios past the, uh, past the fleet. Uh, I just don't like my options. Um, obviously, I, the shortest route is from here, but my forces are split. So, I'd rather keep my forces together. Yep. 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 I'm going to start over here. Uh, artillery. Right here. I'll just go ahead and use them on the on the fleet if I have to. <clears throat> I'll keep them protected. Um Missiles ready! Oop, wrong button. There we go. Battle ready and eager! Thought here just being I want my skirmishers up here, just in case. I'll keep them protected by puppies. Uh, Cause that'll work right. Sure. Um That's how I'm deploying, and I'm sticking to it. Um, we'll see if this is a terrible idea or not. So let's make some groups. Oh, their entire force is on boats. Why? History. Today we sack these city walls. Reinforcing troops, and not a moment too soon. I hate this. Hold on. Well, hold on. I'm gonna pause. Let's think this over real quick. These are tier one troops. I don't see their actual fleet. This is their army out here. There's there's one of their actual ships. And if they're all out here, then who's in the city? Okay. Well, here's my thought. Why don't I just tr tie down their forces with Endicombogios' men and see what I can do from there. So... Let's go ahead and have you board that. I'm just going to start giving orders. Let's tie down their forces, so shall we? Yes, let's shall.
All right, let's see what happens. The enemy has been sighted. No kidding. Just gonna give out some more boarding orders. So that one's an actual Navy crew. All right. Yeah, and I was right about the artillery. This is actually kind of amusing to me right now. Let's just let's just send the dogs to the shore. This will this will be interesting, right? <laughs> this is amusing. Very amusing to me. <clears throat> hey, they got that boat. Just up here having a good time. Let's bring the cavalry over. I mean, why the heck not, right? Our general is being attacked. Keep him alive. My general's gonna live through this. This might be how Enda Kambugios dies. Ah, their forces are coming ashore. Oh, their forces are coming ashore. My unit has gone berserk. Black tidings. Our general is dead. Ah. I lost Enda Kambugios. Oh well. Ready and waiting. He was old. His time had come. I think this is going pretty Borders good for me. On one of our ships. Repel them. I think I'm beating up this Navy. Let's go ahead 
and get everybody on the ground. Bring this boat over. Oh, I've lost control of that unit. <laughs> that amuses me greatly. start shooting where they are. This battle's been interesting. Well, let's just have these guys release their dogs. Oh, they don't have dogs? No! Okay. Just run quickly. Get there. Over like that. One of our units has gone berserk. Get up there. Oh, they actually managed to break through. Hey, the dogs helped though. Chain route. Let's do this. Thank you. End the battle. Oh. Costly but decisive. Costly is what I'd call that. I lost then to Kambugios, but he was old already. All oh, berserkers. 182, 181 kills. I like it. And with that. <laughs> The Celts have conquered Denmark. Yes. Yup. General has been killed and his unit disbanded. Ugh. Oh well. It was costly, but what he got out of that was uh, was the end of the war against the um, the Geats. <clears throat> the Geats are done. Um. You're going to. Hmm, I think we'll just occupy rather than loot and occupy. Don't need the chump change. Alright, so the headhunters need a new army, and I will be damned if I give it to the Ola Maria of Obstinance. Um, I don't know what I have here. So other nobles. This guy's a steadfast defender. 39 years old. Okay. Acuchios. From other families. None of my candidates are from my family, so... Other nobles, other nobles, other nobles. No choice but here. Um, this guy. I'd love to give it to him, but... He just... Uh, he asked for too much too early. So yeah, Acuchios. Fleet ready! Alright, that's going to give plenty of power and authority to my other family members, but let's 
Let's look at the family situation here now. The politics situation. We still got plenty of power. Um, control is still at 64%. My dominion is is fine. Um, Anticabodios is deceased, so my new leader is Segavax, right? And he's the governor. At, <clears throat> he's the governor back home. Um, he's chosen for his heir in Dutu Amaros, his elder brother, who is governor of Britannia Inferior. Uh, plenty of kids on the up and up. Um, this guy had nothing but daughters. A Caledonian wife. Eleven-year-old son, a five-year-old son, a four-year-old son, a one-year-old son. One was a bastard. Three of them are just fine. This will this will work out just great. Got plenty of kids. This is just they need some time before they're ready to take you know offices, positions. <clears throat> let's uh, speaking of offices and positions, let's make you a warlord. Um, he's my only other family member right now. <laughs> So, Pocutius is low loyalty. Hold on. I want to try and secure somebody's loyalty. Him. I did not realize his loyalty was so low. That might help. Alright. <clears throat> so, with that, I control all of Scandinavia, all of um, uh, the British Isles. It's one heck of an empire built up. <clears throat> so what's next? Let's look at Alabama. Let's go ahead and repair. The Sacred Grove we will repurpose into Farmstead. All these are good buildings. Um, that's probably all I can accomplish right now. Making sure... Segavex has gained Andromedy. Is a s scout boots are needed on the long run. Oh, it's just shoes. Okay. 10% campaign movement range? I need to put Segavex in an army. Holy cow. <clears throat> okay. Well then. Just make sure that I've gotten taken care of everything. For the tribe! The headhunters have movement points still. Let's, uh. I know exactly where I need to send them. Ooh, yeah, that's right. And I have a fleet over here, too, chasing this. I'm gonna send this army back towards, um. Back towards all of my places. Yep. Um. 949 income. I think I have to end my turn here. Okay. Uh, before I do that, let's check the diplomatic situation. <clears throat> the Geats are... <laughs> they are floating in the middle of the Northern Sea. This guy, look at him. Hrolfer, 19 years old, his entire culture, his entire religion on his backs. <clears throat> well, goodbye, Geats. I, I guess, actually, I suppose the Danes hold the culture. But this guy, he... Um, nobody that wants to trade with me. Attitudes. Langobards. My friend, we welcome the blessings of Christ, the Savior, to you. Oh, no. Another Christian? Oh. They might be interested in a defensive alliance. Let's try that, see if we can't earn more points. Oh, ow. Okay, fine. Go away. Um, Franks are military access, defensive alliance. Let's see if we can't upgrade that. Franks. Six friend, and let us talk. And let us have good wine until we can talk no more. Low, low. Fine. 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 Um, I wonder where my objectives are right now. Just as a reminder, see where we are. We're in Chapter 2, Desolation, Survive Until Spring of 420, just boys, uh, until it was born from darkness and despair, right. So, no military presence within my territory, West Rome, fine. 
defensive or military alliance with any faction. I've got that. That's good. Be at war with the West Roman Empire. Don't really need a thousand uh, ducats. Is that the income in this game? Gold coins? Whatever. I don't have. I don't need that much economy for it. Like my my trading deal with the Western Roman Empire is much better. And hold a Borkum. Done. Okay. Get me to the year 420 already. I'm 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 set. I got my four generals. Everything's looking pretty good. For Taurus, are you from other families? I think you're from other families. How do I tell if you're from other families? Oh, I could. He's not married. Interesting. I could... Yeah, I can play that game with these people. For Taurus. For Taurus. Definitely not in my family. There he is. Yeah, he's another noble. Anyway, anyway enough of this. End of the turn. Oh, I'm not ending the turn. I'm giving Segavax another point. In something. Ooh, less corruption. Yes, please. Construction cost down? Yes, please. That works for me. Thank you. And turn. So, uh, that's a thing. Suicidal Danes, I guess. Um, let's just kill them. Why? Two boats. They sent a navy of their, their two little boats there. To try and stop, um... Ow! I lost all of my Sighthound Spears and one of my Berserkers. Alright then. 1%. No, just kill me now, please. <clears throat> Alright, well, we killed that guy. I lost four men to attrition. Oh, <laughs> read of Obstinance is... Loyalty is wavering again. Oh, no! Uh, okay, so Inducio Maros is now Warlord. Good for him. Acutius has gained three loyalty. That's good. He was given a victory against the... the... Danes for whatever reason they came after me. I still don't get it. Demolition of the ruined building is complete. Bearded trousers, what? Plus 10 growth? Hold on. I got this guy new pants. And now I get plus 10 growth? Okay. That's gonna that's gonna help Scandinavia a lot. New pants. Alright. Yes. Uh, you've gained some ranks here. Let's uh, give you some more morale. Get you that wolf point. Mm. How can I help? Well, steal from them. I'll just put that there. Let's see what happens. Go, 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 go. Failure. This guy's full of failures. All right. Ready for orders. Regular stance. Let's kill this. Let's kill this. Thank you. Night attack. So I'm not gonna. I'm not going to do this battle. It's tempting because you know it's the end of the uh, the Geats, but uh, there's every likelihood I would lose this battle just because they have so many. Um, yeah, yeah. Just uh, we'll be we'll be protective. See, I did end up losing two ships, a lot of my crews. I lost, actually. It, never mind. Um, we will return. That I did not expect, based on what the um, the power bar said, at all. Did I? I'm gonna have to look back at this recording later. I am. I am shocked. I am shocked. Also, I have another problem. I'm at war with this guy. I think the yeah it's the Rugians um, and they're coming and I'm confused like when would when did I start being at war with the Rugians was that something I did for uh, 
Oh, they, they, oh, they're just, oh. And their army was over here? Rugians, what the heck? This opportunistic little punk. Gods of the afterlife, spare my ass. Well, why do you trouble my digestion today? <sighs> what a jerk. Okay. So I have... This is a problem. Um, that's also a problem. Let's go ahead and get my fleet over out this way as quickly as possible. Maybe sail him out towards here. I'm going to try and keep them in protected waters, I suppose. We'll sail out down this way. <clears throat> Hopefully they'll just, you know, die out here in the sea. That was an unexpected turn of events. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Uh, uh. I think right now that army should just stay here and replenish. But I need to get ready to start moving them out. Maybe go after Gothiskenza. Just to put the pressure against the Rugians who are now coming after me. Ready for orders. All right, let's look at buildings. This should be converted. We're going to go with a sacred well. <clears throat> this should be upgraded to goat herd. That's good. Almost out of money. I'm finally not losing um, public support here, but I can build in Londinium when I have money. I can build in Londinium when I have money. Um, let's. I'm gonna go back here quickly and before I upgrade you. I'm going to use that money on Londinium. Mm hmm. So I can do a farmstead. I'm going to do a town center. Or the iron smelter. It needs help growth. No, none of these help growth. Um... I'm actually going to save my money and I'll do the religious building next turn because I do believe that's actually currently an objective. A mission I have. I'm not sure. Where would that have been posted? <laughs> yeah, construct a building. Um... I want to see if this sacred well counts as having constructed a religious building. I know I'm just converting it um, and upgrading it. And yeah, we'll do the code herd. Okay. It just occurred to me that I'm losing losing sanitation in these locations. Oh boy. Oh well. Next turn. After I upgrade Lanikos. <clears throat> there we go. End the turn. Alright, so... Peculiar turn of events, Rome and Gaul are no longer at war. Illyria and the Saviors are at war. I've built a goat herd. Unseasonal conditions, it's a good spring. Um How can I assist you? Let's go ahead and quickly exploit some corruption here. Another failure. Uh let me show you something. For the tribe! The Geats are sailing towards uh, Scotland. And not only that, the Rogians landed. They're out here next to Camelodunum, um, which is where I'm going to send this navy. Um, 
because, gosh, that's a really, really pathetic replenishment rate, guys. But I can... Mm, cannot produce any more mercenaries here. Um... Also gonna have these guys just full steam out this way. Keep replenishing, that's fine. Uh, we were looking at Britannia Superior. Let's build those uh cairnstones. Alright, one more little turn end and then probably be it. Dangerously low no integrity. Uh, what's the consequence? Mutiny in six turns? That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm sending them home. The wave cutters are gonna replenish. They good. Oh, no. I'm gonna fall back from that. Back! We must rest a while. Oh no. Ugh. What even is this? A Greek fire dromenarian? Are you kidding me? And a full army on these boats. Oh my goodness. I might lose what's left of Andacombogios' army here. Oh, the Danes have come after me. I'm gonna have to save this for next time that I'm out of time. This oh 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 naval battle that I don't have a good power bar in favor of. You know what I'm trying to say. Anyway, uh, I'm just gonna save this here. I'll see you guys next week. It's uh, it's a bit of a cliffhanger. Here we go. I'll see you all next time.